Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, welcome to a brand new video. Today we are playing with my new hair tool and I got this here is an A-Pro by Lux and this may look familiar because it does look familiar. It looks very similar to the Dyson but it's at a fraction of a price so we're gonna test this one uh, if you want to see how I did this hair and it's nice and beautiful keep on watching and thank you Lux for sending me the product they did send it to me I'm gonna tell you my honest opinion and I love it we're gonna style my hair together and before I go to the past me doing my hair. The question of the day, you know, this is a tradition. And question of today is, what is your favorite color? This is probably the question I get asked the most, especially by kids. For me, my favorite color always changes. And the moment forest green is my favorite. And I went through phases of pink and black and blue. I never liked yellow. I don't know, but my favorite color at the moment is forest green and it just, I love everything about the color. I don't know, what is your favorite color? Do you have one? Maybe you have multiple. So if I ask Taya what is her favorite color, she's gonna say it's white, pink and yellow. Always, always with three. Before we begin a bit of tea, this is a spiced apple tea is my favorite this time of year. Mm. Nice. So, I washed my hair and as you can see, I do not have makeup because whenever I do my hair, when it's wet, I do not put makeup first because it's a mess. Heat protecting spray. This is not my favorite. This is just what it was in the shop. I cannot find my favorite, which is a Tresemme heat protecting spray. Uh, but I got this Schwarzkopf keratin heat protecting spray. And three days style control. So hopefully this will also help with styling. So spray this in the hair. Where is the sprayer? I tend to spray my face. So this. Ooh. and brush it through I know you have to be careful when you brush your wet hair but I'm still gonna brush it because otherwise how do I style if I don't brush it the brush I'm using is this like flexible one I know I think I saw something like this in Primark as well but this one is from Savers it was cheap two pounds something and it's very very good I have two of them because I use one for the girls and one for me because when we had one I could never find it so let's open this up the box is very heavy so it's called Lux Air and Every time I see something or I buy something in this kind of boxes, I feel bad for throwing the boxes away because if I don't, I will end up being surrounded by boxes. And it comes in this beautiful case and it says Lux in here. It's so cute. You open it up, boop, ah, wait. I think this one is for putting it down, I guess. And then we have the two bottles and the dryer thingy itself. So this number one and is showing you the direction. It does have an arrow here and this is the other one. And main thing, if I can take it out. Here we are. I just love the colors they are using. And looks like this. It's got all of the patterns and I just love this rose gold here. And it looks like the cord is quite long, which I love every time I have a hair tool that has a long cord. 
I love it because you know we need a long cord so this is pretty long then it does have other attachments this one is the brush then we have the other type of brush sorry for the down brush and then just a normal kind of brush this will be so much easier to dry the girls hair you'll be so good and then just the hair dryer had attachment that looks like so so what i'm gonna do first and we also have a ah, glove i don't really use gloves but if you prefer to use gloves because of the heat so yeah you got the glove here uh, is for right-handed people so if you're left-handed there's no glove but I never actually use the glove even with the uh, um, curling iron um, I just I just don't use it I don't know I don't like using the glove so I'm going to plug this in. I do not have a Dyson for comparison. I think there are plenty of videos already on how this is doing compared to the Dyson. But there is a very big difference in the like, price point. So I cannot compare with a Dyson. Just because I can't get myself to spend so much money on a hair tool. It's £600. It's like £600. It's a bit too much for what uh, I can spend on a hair tool so let me plug this one in go plug right here i tried it down just because if i was gonna talk while this is on you wouldn't hear anything so they have the this is the on button you have to keep it pressed and you will switch on and off and then you get three settings of intensity and free temperature settings the first setting it will be completely cold and then it goes to medium heat and very hot and the same with the strength free strength settings and you do have like the cold button and mainly probably used with a curler so i think i need to maybe give it a little bit of a dry like this before I try this one. So we're switching it on Ooh, and it's quite powerful. Okay, so I put the first bottle on. Uh, I did not get the right bottle from the first try, so play around and see which way you have to do your curls. I always curse away from my face. It's kind of a general rule. And I already tried it and it's so cool. Let me show you. I'm gonna switch it on. I'm gonna take a little piece from the back here like so I wouldn't take very thick um, strings of hair uh, also because mine is quite long so I am intrigued to see if this actually works so switching it on
and face curl it's so cute look at it dun, 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 dun. don't mind this situation here uh i'm on my period so this is normal for me <gasps> so cute oh let's try another one and i am not speeding it up so you know kind of how long it takes and then obviously I'm going to speed up the rest of the ways. We will be here and this video is going to take way too long. So switching it on. And here is the second one. I need to play around and understand how to wrap it properly. I think I was supposed to get um, le get less hair. And also because mine is long, I need to make sure that the ends are wrapped around as well. So put that one there. And we're gonna do this. Let's do this way. Hi. Here you go, number three. Let's do the last one on this side and then I'll come back when I will have to do the top part of my hair. So again, also don't forget to change the barrels when you move on to this side of the head. <laughs> These are all the curls we just did and remember that this is the first time that I'm using a tool like this and I just love it how it just wraps around the barrel on its own and it's so cool. Also make sure that you do the cold shot. If you don't do the cold shot, make sure not to touch your barrel because it will get very hot, hence why probably the glove. And it's so cool and it's so easy to use. This is a great, like such a great multi-styling tool to take with you, especially when you go on holiday. And it's even greater that now you can have an option that is more affordable for everyone. So I'm gonna do this side and then I'll be back when we do the top part. Look at these beautiful curls. Now, let's do the top part because I do have a barrel for this side just gonna do this one first and I am looking that way because I have a mirror because you do need a mirror when to your hair oh. so take a piece
half of my head all done. I obviously need to kind of style it because I didn't want to brush them or touch the curls until I'm done. It looks so fluffy. Let me do the other side. <laughs> Let me go quickly and put my makeup on and I will be back with my uh, photos. Okay, okay, time to show you the hair in full glory and it's so beautiful. It gave me so much volume. I did not put anything in my hair. I just washed it today and I put um, a hair mask, the one from Garnier, which I love so, so much and the heat protecting spray and this is everything i didn't put any texturizing spray i didn't do anything no even oils usually if i go out and i want like a full hair i will add some dry shampoo so it lifts up from the roots i will put some sea salt sea salt spray but this is without anything and it has been a while because i did my makeup i filmed another video for this makeup and I also had lunch and this is how the hair looks like the curls and I know it's giving me so much texture I think I need to add some more layers to my hair you look so much fuller if I'll have probably more layers and it's beautiful I love it it looks like I didn't put much effort actually you don't really put too much effort let me just get it because all you do is just like this get all the hair in wait out it's a great time to put some um, ear pods and maybe watch something or listen to something because there will be no more to do and also this um, device is not too heavy um, and uh, my arm didn't ache. I hate when hair tools are too heavy and then your hand just you can't feel it at the end. My hair dryer that I have now, which is very old and is great, it is a bit heavy. So by the time I'm done, my arm is aching. And I can't wait to wash the girl's hair and use the brush tool. Let me just get it. This one. Because I think this is going to be such a game changer for me when I dry the girl's hair. Because if you know, Emilia's hair is longer than mine and is double the thickness. So whenever it's time to do a hair wash and dry, it takes me one hour just for her. And then I've got the other child as well. But by the time I finish Emilia, Thea's hair is already dry. And this will be great. And it's such a great traveling tool. Basically, you have to... Press the button, release, take it out. It's not big. It's not overly heavy. It does have some weight to it. Don't get me wrong, but obviously it's got everything built in, so it does have to have some weight in it. Great for traveling because it's just one multi-tool. When I went on holiday, I took the dryer because I don't like hotel dryers. They barely blow hair and because we have lots of hair, we are three women in our family. I took my straightener uh, and I took my curler and um, it was a lot. This one, 
it will do the job. So, and um, I guess if you use this the brush tool, let me just put it in like so, it will straighten your hair. So probably I'm gonna use this one next time to see if it's straightening the hair and maybe not leave it fizzy. Thank you Lux for sending me the products. I love it so, so much and I hope you guys love it too. If you want to purchase one, let me know in the comments and I will see you in my next one. Love you, love you.